everyone welcome to my page my name is crystal so today i'm going to briefly talk about ways to jumpstart your mindset going into 2020 let's get started number one building a foundation what i mean by that is investing in yourself i noticed the main common forms of building generational wealth is either investing your money into getting into real estate, flipping homes, or renting any type of properties. Also, I noticed people are starting to put their money into the stock exchange, the cryptocurrency, and also there's a, are starting it to get into starting a business or some type of side hustle. So I'm going to briefly talk about which route I decided to take. So I ended up taking the side hustle route where I found I find that it will be less costly for me to start a brick and mortar um, you have to worry about rent and keeping up with inventory keep and you know travel is a trillion dollar business so every year people are traveling whether it's for family reunions or girls trips or just wedding destinations everybody there's always going to be somebody traveling it's not a saturated industry and I just decided that it would be a good route for me just to get into the online community. And also, income, you need multiple streams of income. Number two, developing a positive mindset. A wise man once said, dreams without plans are just dreams. I find that the best way is to write down where you see yourself three to five years from now and just setting a detailed plan on how you plan on manifesting your dream life. By writing daily goals, it's a daily reminder that you are on the right path and a blueprint for you to strategize on ways for you to create more opportunities for yourself. Number three, learning a new skill. What I mean by that is by learning a new skill, it can be a very valuable asset, whether it's in career field or in life in general. What I, there's many different resources online in order for you to, you know, learn or just build upon that skill. What I mean by that is there's YouTube University, there's Coursera, there's Skillshare, there's podcasts, there's different podcasts out there. Whether you're interested in learning how to make a website or you're learning, you're interested in learning how to make soap or just, you know, make a wig or just get into graphic design. The internet is a free resource for you to look up information on how to become a novice in that skill. Look at other YouTubers. They looked at other YouTubers and I'm pretty sure they read it other books or magazines in order to perfect their the main idea of learning is to practice consistently what I mean by that is always take actionable step take action and always try and then try again and then after that try differently you're never going to get it the first time you're always going to have to keep practicing until you get until you become an expert at it. Four, embracing your fear. You are capable more than you know. Never doubt the gifts that you were blessed with. If any particular thing you're worrying about, it won't happen. And keep in mind, if it does happen, there's two different ways on how to handle the situation. Either you'll journal it and make a backup plan on how to prevent it from happening or you will you know embrace embrace it and then learn from that mistake and then move on from that you know mistake so guys if you found this video informational please hit the like share and subscribe I do want to do more videos like these in the future. Also, check out my travel group. It's on Facebook called Travel Bloom, where if you're interested in learning how to supplement your income and in becoming an online travel agent, please let me know. So till next time, bye.